Hello and welcome to Hello. studio tour. Oh, Ursula has to talk loud, unfortunately, for her. Yeah. Sorry about the audio because we don't have a new fancy mic. But, and we're also apologizing for the dog who will be peeping the entire time that we are doing this. Mm -hmm. So, studio tour is basically a living room tour because our studio is just our living room. Yeah. And if you are a watcher of, a vlog, of the vlog, you'll know that this is a lot cleaner than it usually is. Best foot forward for those dang people that watch our other videos. I don't know. <laughs> the non-vlog people. Mm -hmm. um, so we're just going to go clockwise around the room, maybe? Yeah. Or it's counterclockwise if I'm wrong. So here is just Al. Al being our blue tongue skank, he's he's not part of our studio. He's just oh he's he's here actually. We get some rare Al out of his hot oh some Al action for you. Blue tongue skank living his best life. Up here is our wall of bad children. This is uh, Lear. This is Madika's portrait. Um. Fado's portrait, and Amalthea's portrait. And up here, we have my deer wall, where I have collect deer-related deer. <laughs> and we have my, my, my pen. Oh my god, I, I'm too short. That I have stuck into the wall, as you do. This is um, my grandpa stuff of my grandpa, who is dead. Uh, there is the cat run, and we also like to co collect lenticular um, portraits. This is our lion, tiger, leopard family. As you know, in the wild, they all like to cuddle. Up here is our wolf lenticular portrait. As you can tell, as you walk across the room, it changes into different wolves. We want to get them uh, with gold frames. Please support us on Patreon so that we can do that. This is our table. Um, it is where we put all our stream equipment and we move it in front of the couch when we're streaming. The roll right there is because of puppies peeing on the floor. Uh, that's my fish tank. It's a mess so I won't show you it. Ursula, show off the couch. Show off this lovely couch for us. <laughs> this is where we do all the streaming. Bones will sit here. He's got his little microphone. He's like, hello, hello. Because <laughs> he sinks into the couch. Yeah. Um, There's our one charger. Our one charger. <laughs> for our two laptops. Um, <laughs> he's always piled with pillows because Bones needs to be surrounded by five million of them. Um, this is where I sit. On the microphone. Okay. So I'll sit here. We'll usually have our table in the middle and um, that stand, my laptop goes on it, and then we stream. I think so. Alright, yeah, so that's, yeah. That. that's that. There's our little table, it gets kicked all around the room. Can't have anything on it because the cats knock it off. Mm -hmm. And here is this. Here is my work there. Typically, typically, we're so announced serial. I know. So typically, I'll have my laptop open here. This is Bones' laptop. Um, so I'll have it open. I'll have my tablet all plugged in and go in here. I'll just sit here and draw. So sometimes I'll sit on the couch instead of working here because it's comfier on the couch. Yeah, basically. <laughs> and I just put my tablet in my lap and draw away. Yeah. Um, here's our shelf full of supplies. We're gonna go through it. It's the, it's the, the main piece of bread for this whole thing. <laughs> okay. okay, so, let's start. Very interesting. So here's all our, like, equipment that we need to keep away for when the cats are out, because they will eat it if we're not paying attention. Same with the puppy. What do we got in there? Um, so this is a mic bag. Like you keep your microphone in it. Yeah. You don't use it. Um, Shrieking upstairs. How dare you keep me out of the vlog. How dare. So this is my tablet pen. I've got my little 
protective glove and my pen here and my nibs. I keep it here. Oh, maybe I could put it in here. Oh, that would be a good idea. <laughs> hey, look. Um, here are our headphones that we use for the new audio setup. Yeah. That's what we got. They're very nice. Um, here's my tablet cord. I usually keep it away just so the cats don't get it. Here is our audio interface. Is that it? <laughs> sure. Um, that we got for mic setup. It's nice. Keep it protected. <laughs> um, Protect the expensive box. Oh. Our webcam. Yep. For when we're doing streamy stuff. Um, I've got a... What is it? An external hard drive in here? I've that we do not use. I, I, sometimes I use it. <laughs> you have not backed up in 1,375 days. <laughs> I hate that my computer tells me that. <laughs> um, extra tablet pen. It's been at least three years since you used it, that means. <laughs> We've got a tablet pen, a mouse we never really use. <laughs> Old printer cartridge that we need to recycle. Alright, next box. Um, so this one is mostly pens and my supplies. There's a couple like notebooks and old sketchbooks and stuff. Well, my coworker got this for me. I like my first job. It's beautiful. <laughs> um, there's some uh watercolor paper in here there's like a sketchbook that bones made for me i haven't used yet hell yeah they wanted to practice using a special stapler it was a very good stapler uh, some supplies this is what we usually bring to conventions yeah just got some pencils and stuff in it show it to me Show it to the beautiful team. It's like I got some paintbrush. Oh, that's where my brushes went. Oh my god. And pens and pencils. Right. What's our next drawer? <gasps> this is a fantastical adventure. I hope you guys are enjoying this. packing supplies for bones when he's packing orders from our shop or kickstarters heck yeah so tape roll tape gun that's tape what gun. it's called tape gun for pew pew you got you, you packaging and taping it up it doesn't work all the way no it but doesn't cut <laughs> it doesn't cut but it's good for just getting like a straight line of tape it's true I, it just also isn't great you have a three hole punch for punching three holes this is our long arm stapler. No, it is not. That is just a heavy duty stapler. It's a heavy duty stapler. <laughs> <laughs> long arm is when it can like do books. It just looks really long. <laughs> <laughs> it is not. It is a normal length stapler. Okay. It just has a big punch. We have a scale for understanding the weight of the packages we're selling. And weighing lizards. Yes. That too. Never actually weighed my lizard. I'm a bad Lizard dad. Um, I won't show some of this because there's a script and some orders. If it's possible. Inktober 2019. 2018. And Sundu, who was left alone, unclaimed. Poor Sundu, it sounds like her. I guess so there's that one. So there's Sundu. There's all the old Inktobers. Mm hmm. I love them, they're so good. They're super cute. We should frame some. We should. That'd be really cute. We could have a wall of your Inktobers. Oh god. <laughs> I'd want it. A nightmare. Well, you can see them all. We have a PDF on Gumroad of all of them. Yeah. Here's our Christmas card from 2018. Oh, yeah, we gotta make our 2019 one really quick. Yeah, we do. We can send it out on time. Oh. <laughs> We went to Royal Medieval Times for VIPs. Yeah, well, there's lots of Medieval Times stuff right now. Yeah, yeah. We went yesterday, so. Yeah, I'm with 
Lanyards are good to keep. They are. They're handy for when you go to conventions and you oh, need... Oh, I thought they were handy for when you want to have 25 Tamagotchis. <laughs> um, packing tape. Heck yeah. Lots of scissors. We have a clamp here for holding cardboard, our cardboard packaging that we put on our books. Mm -hmm. You hold it down so you can tape it so it doesn't slip. We bought too small of a clamp, so I just use my hands. Yep. Clamps are nice but though. They're useful. For something. We got if it you though. Need to hurt someone. <laughs> hurt someone. Awesome. Need to pinch someone's finger. Um, so we have a bunch of nine point. Oh yeah. I guess if you can read that, you get a free ebook. <laughs> you have some notebooks. Is this one? That's a very good notebook. Calico scourge. Um, sticky notes. Calculator. <laughs> um, some old, uh, button tops so we make little like um packets I, of buttons. I think we have one of those in there. Yeah, some more. Oh, here it is. So we make these. And then, and then put, you put the thing on top yeah. to put on the spinny rack. Mm -hmm. Some dried out markers that we should probably get rid of. <laughs> <laughs> um and lots of ballpoint pens because you always need a pen and you always lose them. Yep, always buy 500 pens. Some glue. Glue, twine, twine, measuring tape, uh, scotch, scotch tape, tape, some little bowl clips. To, they're really good for holding your script together if you print it out. So this one is full of candles and incense because we are into that. So, yeah, so we have a bunch of incense that we got. Um, candles. These are the black candles I got for Bones' birthday. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Very spoopy. Lighters. Um, we have some inks for stamps. Here's one of our stamps that we got. Hmm. There's a few other ones. There's some like cat ones. Like. There you go. <laughs> um, I have an itty bitty watercolor. <laughs> Heck yeah. Hell yeah. Uh, staples. There's another pack of staples in here somewhere. A little tin. We don't have anything in it. It's just cute. Maybe we'll use it one day. A lighter. Some little pokey patches. Mm -hmm. Um, there's more staples. High capacity staples. Hell yeah. Yeah, that's it. Okay, and what's up here? We have a cat. Okay, what is, what is under her? Um, some library books. Hell you. Yeah. Um, this is my... Uh, cat warmer? Yes. <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, this is a carrying case I use for my laptop. I also have a Wacom tablet that's like upstairs somewhere. That sometimes I will stick it in this little pouch and carry it with me for if I ever want to go out and do some travel drawing. Um, here's a sketchbook with a cat on it. <laughs> um, so it is a sketchbook full of cat hair. Yeah, that's what her multi likes to sit on. Yeah, it's her, her bed. Um, but yeah, it's full oh, of... Oh yeah, because all those shelves along there, that's where like the cat... That's the little kitty cat runway. Yeah. Um, but this has a bunch of the early Nine Point stuff in it. I should probably do a sketchbook tour sometime. Mm -hmm. but Put book sticky model. notes over the spoilers. Oh my, oh my god, we're never getting this done. This is my printer. There's a thing on it. There's a tripod in the back we got for $2. Do you want to go through all this stuff down there? Oh jeez, there's like a script in there. <laughs> Yeah, it's because I accidentally printed it. Um, I don't know if we have anything cool in here. We just have like lots of different types of paper. Um, we have colorful paper. You want to show that? So we got a bunch of like colorful scrap paper type things. I don't know what you use them for. My mom gave them to me. Thank you, Kim. <laughs> well, we have a book in here. <laughs> Apparently. 
This is a good book. It's a very good book. I recommend it for learning composition. Yeah. Um, good composition book. Yeah, that's more paper. It's just like scrapbooking tape papers. Mm-hmm. And there's photo paper, cardstock. Router. Router. Modem. Yeah. Which one's which, Ursula? That's the router and that's the modem. Oh, I'm so proud of you. Yeah. <laughs> got a scratching post, got another scratching post, got bags for some reason. I think I emptied like a con thing. Oh. And then like 500,000 pieces of paper in here. Mm -hmm. And it's so heavy. Um, in here is all of our doggo stuff and our catto stuff. There's just all sorts of toys. A donut. They're just spoiled rotten. Mm -hmm. Literally rotten. Because I almost stepped on them and Ursula cried. At, the, at some point there was a cut scene. That's what happened. There's... A cut scene. <laughs> There's the cat tubes where cats appear and disappear. There's a little cat clam that cats sleep in. All these little bowls for every single baby in the house. Uh, here's my, uh, what is it, those things? Plants. Um, running water, because cats like to drink running water, because they're prima donnas. Uh, cat tree, so the cats can sit in the sun. By cats, I mean Amalthea can't tell because her hair. Treadmill. Like it that. used to smell really bad because we got it really cheap from a smoker with one leg. Um, we got some weights in the back. We got my favorite thing here which is my nine point height chart. IRL. It shows you the height of every single species. We've got weights, a vacuum, poopy shoes, for going into the the puppy muck um yeah here's our dining table where we where we dine um the lovely candelabras that ursula got me for my birthday mm -hmm. a zillion candles it's all decked out for halloween with the spidery thing medieval times hat mm -hmm. crown and my flag dehumidifier all the cat foods under there. There's a litter box, don't look inside. Here's my fish tank. It's very lovely. I got all my fish supplies underneath and our robot vacuum oh, yeah. who tries her darndest in a house full of five fluffy animals. There's the top shelf that we didn't clean. And now we can go through this thing. A little, a little bookshelf tour. Oh, God. So these are Ursula's favorite books. I love them a lot. They're really good. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, so there's my Cassie Claire altar. Here's... Wait, there's my, my hourglass. It's a beauty. Here's all the manga I collected as a kid. <laughs> Winnie the Pooh, the best manga. <laughs> um, we also have books by our friends. We have um, Jake Yakas' books. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. We have some other books we've collected. More J stuff. Um, a friend Vanessa's book. Um, you can talk a little louder, it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> this is how we talk. <laughs> um, yeah. yeah, and then that's the books. We've got Hunted Wells. This is actually. Wait, I'm over here. Oh. I'm looking at the lamb skull. Um, more J stuff. It's like a pin. If I slick could lift it for me a little bit. Lift it up ways. It's a really pretty pin. Mm -hmm. It's like Aphrodite, I think. Yep. Uh, I got roe deer antlers. And then, yeah, honey walls, proof copy. All these <laughs> all fancy my books. Black books. Yep. <laughs> but that was very aesthetic. There's all these books. My Lee Bardugo books. Mr. Monster, that's a good series. That's a really good series. Clockwork Prince and Angel, because mm -hmm. Ursula never collects things in the same type of things. Uh, Coyote Face. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I thought it looked really good on top of the Six of Crows and Crooked Kingdom and whatever the frick that is. <laughs> our, 
This is our gubbin shelf where we throw gubbins that we, we don't know where to put them. <laughs> Everyone has one of those. Most people have it hidden though. These are my video games. Let's see. We got the Game of Life, best game ever. Oh, hell Breath yeah. of Fire 3, hell yeah. Spyro the Dragon, Diablo, Spyro, Spyro. See, I knew I had Spyro. Legend of Zelda, Skyward Sword, never played that. Soul Calibur. Oh my goodness, Aragon, yes. Yeah. Fable, I played so much Fable. Yeah. Most of these we don't even have the system for, so like. Yeah. These are all of um, our copies of Nine Point. You want to take one out and show the world? Just show a Nine Point. I don't think it's all of our copies. I think it's a lot of them, though. But yeah, they come in like a little thing. Yep. And then we ship them in those little file folder thingies there. They're really stuck yeah. in. <laughs> um, here's old versions of Magpie. New versions. Uh, my proof copy that I've wrapped up for some reason. Oh. I don't know what that other book is. Um, up here we have my Lord of the Rings. Last Unicorn. We have three of them. <laughs> Our cat themed books. Um, Unicorns the game. That game is so fun. Uh, dog shampoo, um, <laughs> <laughs> Christmas Carol and stuff. Here is my uh, field stuff. <laughs> so we have a coyote skull, field guide to insects, whatever that is, whatever that is. Um, my uh, this is my bird book, which I have like tabbed through extensively. Uh, each tab <laughs> correlates to a. Um, a place in Nine Point, my comic, because I have uh, real life animals in there and I want to know where their like range is in the story. Uh, raccoon skull, some amethyst, I uh, forget what that blue stuff is. We have some carrion crow feathers, um, mink skull, muskrat skull, arctic fox skull, candle. <laughs> Um, here's our comic shelf, which you guys probably will like, because you guys like comics, right? So here's what we have. We have Cucumber Quest, Hellboy, Watchmen. We like to kind of like paw through these ones as like little references. If you're not on the shelf, it's because we either don't buy your- <laughs> It's either we haven't bought your book, or it's not good enough. <laughs> you decide. <laughs> Um, and these are all of our, um, so it's like all of our comics that we have and then it like switches over to like writing reference and art reference. So we have, um, first aid, which is good for writing. No plot, no problem. Um, Western way, I don't know what half these are. <laughs> and then we have our comic advice ones. Mm. And down here is our sketchbook collection, I think. Yeah, there's like a coloring book in here. There's my 30 days of comics books. I don't know what that is, don't, don't at me. Boobs 2019? 2017. Oh. Um, oh, Devado is down here because it's too big. Mm, it's tall. Uh, these are some uh, just big books. Um, all of these binders are my Calico, uh, Scourge of Nine Point script because I like to keep it in like hard copy so that if I accidentally delete the file I don't lose three volumes worth of script. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's just like an extra thing. And then these are all my copies of Honeywalls. And by all I mean like most of them. Hers is failing to get them. Yeah. They're like our printed version of them. They're very soft. Yes. And I think that's that. Bonus round. This is Madoka. She's a very helpful girl. She's my little art assistant. Uh, no, she is my writing assistant. That is her spider toy for her birthday. Al has come out. He is now sunbathing. We have to get close because otherwise he's like overexposed. He does not want to be on camera. He's walking away. Madoka didn't realize we had a lizard, apparently. <laughs> This little boy is, sorry, this little punk is Fado. He's sporting a werewolf jacket because he supports the Moonlight Anthology, which is coming out this Sunday. 
This girl is ready for Halloween. We have two other ones, but they don't love us. Come on. Here we go. This is my uh, my video game horse who shows up from nowhere. Whenever I go, he is lovely. His name is Lear. Lear and Amalthea, last unicorn. Can you tell that we like it? <laughs> <laughs> and Serena is banished. I keep showing you the terrible state of like our front hallway where all our garbage was thrown. All right, I hope this was lovely. Mm -hmm. um, what other videos do you want, guys? Like, comment, and subscribe if you want us to give up. <laughs> oh, sorry, if you want us to keep going, okay. like, comment, and subscribe. Hell yeah. Everyone tell her Slushy's lovely. Anyone who says otherwise is banned. Good, right? Yeah. Okay, goodbye.